So you've got the Mavic 2 Pro, and you want to use the new 10-bit color profile, but you notice it's got a lot of lens distortion. So how do you fix it? Well, let's see how to do it in Resolve. Okay, guys, so I've got a couple clips here. Um, in fact, I've got four clips. I've got one here that's a H.264 standard color uh, clip. The other one is a D-Log H.265 clip. And then I've got another H.264 clip uh, with an HLG um, 265 clip. Obviously, the D-Log M and the HLG clips both have the lens distortion in the Mavic Pro uh, because of hardware limitations. So you have to correct it in post. So I'm going to show you how easy it is to correct. Okay, the first one is if you have the studio version, the, the paid one, uh, it's really easy to do. All you need to do is select the clip, go into the inspector, and then go into lens correct. And rather than analyze, which doesn't seem to work very well, I have by trial and error figured out the exact value. It's 0.145. So uh, we put that in there. Now, if you compare the two clips, the one with distortion and without, obviously there's outside of the uh, saturation you can see it's right in line okay so that's all you have to do if you've got the paid version now if you don't have the paid version you've got the free version uh, with DaVinci Resolve 15 you can now do this all in Fusion so in this clip here uh, we've got a standard one that has you know the standard H.264 um, normal color profile uh, with the D-Log M and all you have to do here is to go into Fusion. So select the clip, and then we're going to click on Fusion. And then here we're going to go into the Effects Library, Tools. I'm going to go into Warp, and then just click on Lens Distort. And it puts a little node right there. So now we're going to go over here into the Inspector under Lens Distort Model. Uh, we'll leave it here at the 3DE Classic LD Model, but under Distortion, we're going to put in 0 0.079. And then under Quartic Distortion, we're also going to put 0 0.04. Okay, so now if we go back here to uh, and compare the two clips, you can see uh, the lens uh, distortion has been corrected. Okay, so that's all you have to do. Two methods to do it. If you've got the paid version or the free version, if you've got any questions, just leave those in the comments below. Otherwise, please like and subscribe and stay tuned for the next tutorial. Peace.